Jordan Kasumi here. How's it going? Hope everyone is doing well today. Uh, today I want to let you know about a little experiment that I'm going to be running over the weekend, actually for the next four days. And it's based on this uh, four-day cash machine by Frank Kearns. Actually, it's exactly on this four-day cash machine because I'm going to follow everything step by step exactly like Frank lays it out in this uh, little book here. It's only about 10 pages long, so it's really easy to follow. Now, um, basically what I'm doing is I'm going to be doing like a, a special sale offer for over the next four days and I'm going to be emailing a small portion of my list uh, letting them know about this sale, okay? I've got this uh, little product or web-based app called the Timeline Slicer Pro. It's basically just a timeline cover creator or generator, whatever you want to call it, uh, but it, you know, on steroids. It's, it's based off like uh, the Photoshop, right? Everything it has in there is based off like Photoshop, so it's basically like a web-based Photoshop. Anyways, I'm going to be sending this four-day cash machine thing uh, to that small portion of the list. It's a small list that I've been building. It's called an exit pop-up list. It's basically the people that go to the site, right, and exit out for whatever reason they did not buy. And then I have this pop-up that comes up with a bribe saying, hey, I have a free version of this. Why don't you go check it out? Just give me, give me your email and tell me where to send it, right? So I've been building a small list. It's about 700 people, very small. And I really haven't done much selling to them at all. I mean, really nothing. I've been building really good will with them, really good relationship with them, and, you know, getting them to know, like, and trust me, right? Which is what you want to do with the list, right? Uh, become, like, friends with them, right? So, anyways, uh, this little four-day cash machine teaches you how to do that, how to run a four-day sale without really pissing your list off, right? So, um, you may or may not remember about a week ago, well, depending on uh, if you're new or not, but about a week ago or so, I did this video and wrote a post on this powerful message on suspending disbelief, right? And in this video, I talked about a, a launch that I'm working on for a private client, which is going very, very well, by the way, right? It's an off niche, something that has outside and has nothing to do with the how to make money niche. It's going very, very well, surprisingly, right? Well, anyways, as I'm going through the mass control stuff, because it was a mass control launch, I'm going through all this stuff, and I'm like, man, why haven't I done this in such a long time? It worked so great back then. Why haven't I done it in such a while, right? So I decided to go ahead and whip this up, say, you know what? Let me go ahead and try it out and see what happens, and I'm going to do it to that little list, okay? Now, this 4 formula or 4 cash machine works very well for a list that knows, likes, and trusts you. It's the only way that it'll work. Back then... Um, it didn't work well for me. I was just starting out. I didn't have much of a list, so I was working with new people that were just coming in. Didn't work well for me, right? This not to say it doesn't work, but it works more for a list that knows, likes, and trusts you already. Which is why I created the four-day formula. If you remember, or if you're not familiar with it, it's from the, the greatest experiment ever ebook, which I talk about the four-day formula, which is just really much shows you how to do this same thing almost, but with a new list. Okay, to build that goodwill and build that relationship and that bond and, and that trust, which is what I've been doing with this list. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to run a special on the Timeline Slicer Pro and say, hey, you guys didn't like it for whatever reason. Hope you guys have been trying out this, the new one. Hope you like it. Well, here's the deal. I'm going to give it to you for like half off or something, right? So, um, you know, just to see how it works out. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to document everything. Okay, this is going on for the next four days. Actually, right now is 12.32 uh, p.m. It's early afternoon, okay? And it's going, the first email is going out around 4 o'clock, 4.30, okay? And it ends, the sale ends on Sunday night at 11.59 p.m., right? Monday morning, 12 or midnight, whatever, right? So I'm going to document everything, and then come Monday, probably most likely Tuesday, I'll have the, the post ready. Um, I'll have everything for you, all the numbers, how many opens, how many clicks, how many sales. I'm even going to give you my emails, the exact emails that I sent out, okay? So you guys could go ahead and model after, so with your business or whatever. Because uh, this is what he does. He, he, te he basically gives you the emails that he used, and then you just reword it to fit your niche. So I'm going to do the same thing. I'm not going to give you his emails, because that would be like copyright infringement, whatever, I'm going to give you my emails. Everything that I use, the emails, the website, the link, everything, okay? I'll have it like on a little PDF file or something so you guys can download. And then you guys can model after that, 
rewrite it, reword it, just to fit your business and your niche, and then hopefully it'll work out for you, okay? So it'll be a good, fun little quick experiment to see, not really to see how much money I make, but just to see how well I've been building the goodwill, establishing that trust and that bond, and that, and that bond. And just to see, you know, see what happens because I really didn't sell anything. It's a small list and let's just uh, see what happens, right? So I'll keep you guys posted. Um, that's pretty much it for now. Let me get uh, back to work here and uh, finish, uh, you know, uh, scheduling the, the other emails, or the other two emails. And then that's it. I'm, I'm off. I'm done for the weekend. Really, I'm going to shut down after that. Have fun with the wife and kids and then come back on Monday morning open up and see what the numbers are, okay? And I'll let you guys know about it, all right? So with that said, Joey Kissimmee, peace. I love you for free.